Hello friends, in this video tutorial we will discuss about the working of automatic street light. How the automatic street light work? I think you all are aware with the automatic street light. With the help of automatic street light, the street light can be turned off without need of any person or without presence of any person. With the help of the circuit, the street lights gets off during daytime and gets on during night time. So we will learn how this circuit works. Before uh, starting the working, let's see what are the components which are required to design this circuit. So for designing the circuit, we will use two transistor having the number BC548. Basically these transistors are NPN transistor, NPN silicon transistor and uh, we will use two resistances 100 ohm and uh, other for 1 kilo ohm and one other resistor that is a light dependent resistor LDR so basically this will uh, control the operation of the circuit now we will use one 9 volt battery and one LED basically this is a light emitting diode when it gets forward bias it emits light for the forward bias its positive terminal should be connected to the positive terminal of the battery and negative terminal should be connected to the negative terminal of the battery in that case it will be forward bias and it will emit the light so if we see here the LED it is connected to the positive terminal but the negative terminal is connected through a transistor so this LED will be glow only when this transistor will be working so we have to check the behavior of this transistor how it is behaving when we connect here battery and light is fall on the LDR or it is blocked on the LDR. In these two cases we will predict the behavior of the circuit. So this is the circuit. So you can implement this circuit. Uh, we have designed the same circuit on the PCB and we have soldered the same. You can watch the video of this. Uh, how you can solder this. That video is available. So we can explain uh, its working in uh, two cases. First is during daylight when light is available like this. In this case, I'm connecting battery. So you can see when I connect battery, LED is not glowing. Now the question is that why it is not glowing? That understand that thing. Why it is not glowing? When I connect here battery, then this terminal is connected to positive, okay? And this current goes here. LDR have very low resistance when light is fall on it during daytime its resistance will be very low so current will pass here and this junction collect uh, this is the emitter junction will be forward bias because here the voltage will be approx 0.7 volt so this junction will be forward bias and when we see the voltage across this terminal and this terminal here this terminal have lower potential and this terminal have higher potential therefore this junction is also that is the collector junction this junction is also forward bias so this transistor will be in saturation region basically a transistor operate can operate in three regions one is the active region in active region emitter junction should, uh, should be forward bias and collector junction should be reverse bias and the second is the saturation region. In saturation region, both the junctions should be forward bias. So basically this transistor is working in the saturation region because this junction is in forward bias and this junction is also in forward bias. So it will operate in the saturation region. Third region of operation is the cutoff region in which both the junctions are in reverse bias. That is the cutoff region. So, but our this transistor is working in the saturation region. So here the voltage will be very less very less. Or that voltage will be appear here. Due to that less voltage, this junction will be reverse bias. When this junction will be reverse bias, this junction will automatically reverse bias. The transistor will be off. Therefore, this LED is not glowing. Now we can check this. Exactly it is happening or not. First of all, I will check the voltage across base and emitter this is the base terminal this is the emitter terminal i am checking the voltage across these two terminals you can see 
the multimeter the voltage is approximately 0.758 volt so it is four bias okay and if i check the voltage across collector junction you know collector terminal and emitter terminal then see the voltage it is 0 0.018 volt so this voltage will be appear here this voltage will appear here and this voltage will be available across these two terminals base and emitter you can see we can check this also 0 0.018 this voltage is available here therefore this transistor is not working it is an off state cut off state here no current will flow and the LED will be off okay so this is the case one operation when the LDR is in daylight but if I block the light or if I talk about the night like this if I am providing actually you can see due to the loose connection to something happening yeah so when I am blocking the light in that case it is working and it is glowing in this case here the voltage will be rise you can see you can check the voltage whether it is voltage 0.018 or it is hiked you can see let's check yes 0.746 hmm? 0.735 you can feel the change when we are blocking the light how the voltage appearing here is changed so when we block the light its resistance increases up to some mega ohms up to few mega ohms so in this direction low current flow and this transistor gets in cutoff region and this transistor start working and the current is start flowing from here and LED glow okay I think it's working is clear if you like this explanation or working of the circuit please share this video to your friends like this video thank you